I began to study the creeping thistle plant with a scanner during the summer of 2012. It quickly became one of my favorite plants to scan because its dance is so incredibly multifaceted and unique. The fact that it's an extremely common weed in much of the world makes me even more excited to talk about it, as the processes it undergoes are happening around so many people, even in urban environments. At first, I scanned the creeping thistle's beautiful pink flowers and its fascinating seed heads individually. The vibrancy of the many pink florets stands out against the cosmic black backdrop created by the scanner. I love how they subtly waver before desiccating and being pulled downwards. What happens next is remarkable, and shows how a specimen will perform in different manners depending on when it's picked. After the florets desiccate, the bracts that form the inflorescences in Volucre begin to spread in an attempt to release the mature seeds, which, in this specimen, never fully developed. In these shots of mature individual seed heads opening, which were picked later, you can see this process of the bracts spreading actually serving a function. It's remarkable, but it gets better. Creeping thistle really began to come to life for me when I had the thought to put an entire plant on a scanner to see what would happen. I was flabbergasted after a few days to see an intricately connected web of seeds emerge from the collective output of the plant's many densely packed seed heads. During the summer of 2013, I returned to the plant to scan it at a higher frequency to capture the manner in which the plant ejects its seeds in a more fluid way. Watch it for yourself. It does so in a very peculiar manner. I love the negative space that is created as these seeds become partially ejected from the thistles in Volucre. The individual fibers of the papai elegantly form a graceful plume above the brown achenes. Here's a remarkable shot of the creeping thistles in Volucre after its seeds had long since flown away. Watch it sail across the glass and change color. Insects can often add something unexpected to footage. Look at this shot as a larva interacts with a seed as it's being pushed by the expanding seed head. Here you can see the delicate papi of a few creeping thistlechines trapped in an embrace between the plant's painfully serrated leaves. They must have gotten stuck instead of flying away, 